G'day team, uh, this short video is of the Oeriri uh, River area um, and this is my day or two away looking around in some big water um, hopefully you enjoy and if you do please subscribe um, and feel free to share with your friends so there's a dock hut at Brown's, I think it's Brown River Flat or something like that uh, that you can stay at um, and yeah you can see there's a, it's quite a big river I zoom in there see the hut, are they the bridge and uh, good bushland all around so plenty of shelter if it gets too hot because it is quite warm today and it's a bit overcast but that's all good So I've done one kind of half pan, um, just on an inside bend, behind a rock on an inside bend. Um, there was some foliage, a little bit of foliage growing through the, the sand, so it um, hasn't been touched in a while. And I'll show you what I got, I'm not too upset with it, the first bloody half pan. So I just took it in there, just to scrape off the top. And there is like six to seven bits so I'll, I'll do another couple of test pans here go a little bit deeper have a look at the surface uh, around here and just see if it's uh, more of a recent flood gold or historic flood gold So I just cleaned up a pan, I think it's looking pretty good. Done a rough uh, clean up from the sluice. Um, I have panned over another pan because I know I'm going to lose uh, some of the gold uh, and then I will um, um, clean it up when I get home. Um, but uh, I'll show you what I've got so far that I've got left in the heavy, heavy iron sand um, left in the big pan. So this is the stuff I'll go through, I'll pan again. Still a lot of iron sand in there. But I don't know if you can see. It's probably because it's not in water. Maybe I'll put it there. There's actually a nice run of colour through there. So, not too bad. You can see it coming through.
now I can see gold in the V groove, which is great. Piece down here, little bits and pieces over there, pieces up the front. Hello team, so I've had a pretty good day, um, day one almost down, I'm just going to cross the river and go up there a bit, I've found a lot of bedrock, um, and then there's been like a, slot, a side flood creek, which is uh, exposed bedrock as well, so I'll go through there and have a look as well. But Morning team, um, so I was just thinking about where I was yesterday, and it appears that it was on Brown River, um, it only occurred to me this morning um, that the hut is Brown River Hut. Um, so I'm going to cross the uh, Aoriri River this morning and try and head up that uh, branch um, and just see what's happening up there. Hopefully, hopefully something. Um, it's bloody hot today, so I'm going to um, make sure that I'm sunscreened up bug sprayed up and um, I've got my uh, hoochie, my half shelter which I might end up having to set up a bit of a sun shelter with because um, I'm going to get my ass handed to me today uh, but hey, it's beautiful Okay, this is going to be a mammoth task um, but I'm, at the moment I'm just focusing on behind big cobbles with a little bit of gravel just do a few test pans and see what's up and then I might head up stream a bit further and if you can see it the sun might screw it up uh, but up here there's bedrock um, so I might go there and do a bit of um, snooping around the bedrock um, I've got my uh, my goggles and snorkel so if I feel that way inclined um, I might jump in for a bit of a snipe um, it's a nice enough day I've already been halfway up uh, in the water so it's probably no harm doing the whole thing So a couple more colours, um, and I've got some boulders, so I'll work around that I think, I'll just keep going. I don't get any more than um, um, four or five colours in the next couple of uh, pans, then I'll just move on to another place, there's no shortage, <laughs> there's thousands of square kilometres I, um, I'd say, bloody massive. Team, so I'm at the... Um, uh, El Riri, uh public fosking site, the second one, which is downstream from where I've been. Um, I've come down to the end of 15 mile, just where it enters the main river, which is where the uh, site starts. But I've kind of, um, I'm buggered. Um, you'll see why in a second. got massive, massive deep water um, and I'm kind of landlocked, there's uh, bedrock everywhere else so I'll have a scout around anyway 
I don't um, plan on going as hard as I have been the last few days. Um, I'd love to get across the other side. I may uh, walk up the road um, up here and try and cross above there onto this uh, inside bend. Um, but I'm not really going to go all out. Um, if it's easy, I'll do it. If it's not, I won't bother. But anyway, if I come up with anything, um, I will let you know. So I'm going to do a few pans. Obviously, the flow's that slow. I can't get the sluice up and running. Uh, so I'll just pan it today, and I'll let you know if I get anything. Hey, team. Um, so it's about quarter to two. Um, I've only I've kind of spent a few hours. I've probably done about 60 litres um, of concentrated um, gravels and put them through the sluice. Cleaned out the sluice, it looks pretty good. Uh, it's not going to be record breaker but um, it all adds up and um, couldn't couldn't ask for a bit of scenery. It's not not like you're jammed up in a tiny little creek bed um, with no sun. In fact it's probably the opposite here, you're getting too much sun. My pasty ginger body ain't built for the sun so um, I'm going to take a bit of the battering and between that and the sand flies um, I don't know how much longer I'll be here. Um, I'll show you the hole I've done and then um, um, when we get home I'll do a bit of a clean up and a bit of a weigh up. So a good size hole there. It's about um, three, four hundred mils deep in the middle. It goes through clay layers uh, and then silty layers. So it's um, it's pretty good.
that's just been stuck out of my snuffing bottle. I've still got about three litres of concentrate to go through, but I haven't got time. I did my um, snuffing bottle because I'm heading away again tomorrow. So I'm going to do a clean up today. Um, I have got the Ariri uh, River concentrates, um, courtesy of uh, Kuti Time, um, and I'll clean those up. They're from the 24th of December, 25th of December. So um, I'll do that now. So, looking pretty good, uh, always more impressive when it's in the water, but um, it's pretty much 90% down this uh, little clean-up sluice, um, so I'll do this a few times and I'll hand pan it and get all the iron sand off it, um, good fun either way, good to see the gold. So first flush through, um, it's looking pretty good. It's quite a nice little um, pan full. I'll show you. I will uh, 
I'll be putting into my um, kind of waste bucket over here and maybe if I get to uh, 500 subs um, in the next uh, say 6 12 months fingers crossed <laughs> um, I might give away a pay dirt 0 0.4 6 0